was the part where no one's supposed to work? I don't care. We'll make it work. We have to. Maybe it's time you told me exactly what you saw in that machine. It's not what I saw. It's... It's what I felt. They have a queen now. They're not gonna... Ah, good, you're here. Grab this module off the table. Jack's about due for an upgrade. Done. What's it do? Follow me. So a couple of days ago, I sent Paddock a care package. Some DBs and some leeches. Hmm. Intriguing. Potentially disastrous, but intriguing. Thank you. See, the way you described Niles' machine gave me an idea. I call it Hijack. Go ahead. Try it out. What the? Show him what you got, Jack. Whoa. You figured out how to override the hive mind? Uh, no. Jack just floods their brains with voltage. It's crude, doesn't last long, but it works. So which swarm can we use it against? Well, our test subject data is limited, obviously, but... Uh, you know what? Go nuts out there. See what happens. Oh, uh, one more thing. Stop by and see Paddock before you go. He's out front. One more thing, Derek. Once we get this hammer up, I need to know if... Come have a look, too. Until a few weeks ago, we were holding out fine against your so-called swarm. Then everything changed. They got smarter. Suddenly, they were wearing armor. They started making these. Take one, if you want. So you all have been fighting the swarm alone? Yes, which is why I agreed to let Baird come here. We help you with your rocket launch. You help us take back our land. Speaking of which, our water supply cut off. We've been trying to restore it, but your swarms made that difficult, to say the least. Getting the hammer up's our priority, but say we help. What do you need? Our water tower. You'll pass it on the way out. Haven't heard from my people there in a while. Could be nothing, could be something. Check in if you can. All right. And now the big question. Are you children really prepared for this? Because your skiff's ready on the runway, and the desert awaits. Okay, man. Before we go, I got a bone to pick. A big one. Sure. Pick away. You lied to me. And then, after you got hurt... You pushed us away. Like... Like, we didn't even know you. All right, I know why we're here. But where are we going? An old rocket hangar, to the east. And just a heads up, the nomads could use some help, too. Then let's do it. <laughs> Hold up, man. You can't just say, let's do it, and make the last few months disappear. No, come on. No, it's OK. Let him get it out. No, 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 see, that's not fair. You're being all reasonable, and I want to stay mad. Then stay mad. Not here to prove anything. Just here to help. As am I. So it appears his decency's rubbing off on me. Delta, Paddock just let me in on something. It's kind of relevant. When the UIR base commander thought he was going to lose to the rebels, he infected all military computers with some sort of boot sector virus. Meaning most of the tech we'll find out here has been bricked for decades. Yeah. Jack should be able to power past any remaining malware and reboot the machine. He just needs access. <laughs> All right, Baird. Understood.
gotta be the rocket hangar. So let's park this thing and find an old rocket. Paddock said there's plenty of swarm out here, so stay sharp. Shit, you're here. So, how are we handling this? They're on us! Take them out! We're pinned down! We gotta deal with those turrets! Quite the welcoming party. Come on, let's get inside. Jack, shot track. Mm -hmm. Oh shit! Warm was coming from the main building! Bobler, mm -hmm. keep it back! Good night. Paddock, the swarm tried to stop us, but we're heading into the hangar now. Good. Your rocket should be inside. Let me know when you need translations, because you will. I speak five languages. <laughs> so, where do we go? The place looks huge from the outside. It's gotta have a mission control. Or command center. Or whatever the UIR are called. Hey, mission control is accurate enough. And keep going. It's close. Another door. Help me. This must be the place. Let's get some light in here. Well, the lights work at least. And I'd say we found the rocket hangar. Maybe I need new glasses, but I'm not seeing any rocket. Paddock, Barry. The hangar's empty. Well, shit. If the rocket was moved, there's gotta be a record of it. You know what? Hack into an access port. Let's see if Jack can bypass that virus. Okay, Jack. Let's pull some records. Okay, Jack's giving me a window into the mainframe. Whew, that's some nasty malware. Adaptive. Semi-sentient. Don't worry, Jack's got this. R right, buddy? <laughs> ah, no virus can stop Jack. Huh, data's coming in. Got it. I assume you can read this? Yes, but much of it is encrypted. 
Okay, the rocket's nose cone is close. Check the assembly chamber on the other side of the hangar. Nose cone? What about the rocket? The hammer satellites are part of the nose cone. Go deal with that, and we'll keep digging on the rocket's location. Wilco, Delta out. All right, let's go find those satellites. Fuck, you bad, Gary. Did you read those files? Nah. I was born in here. Okay, what now? Well, let's bring that, uh, platformy mm -hmm. thing this way. It's called a gantry. Is it, then? Finally, something I can drive. Come on, you lot. All aboard. Okay, Foss. Take us across. With pleasure. One thing, children. I mentioned how the UIR attacked that facility and tried to launch our Hammer of Dawn satellites. Yeah? I led that attack. You did? Why? To destroy the Kong. Yeah, well, makes sense. Uh, these days, I'm somewhat less interested in destroying the Kong. Good to know, Paddock. Okay, let's go. This way to the satellites. Give me a hand. Keep looking. Static. I'm curious. How long did your siege against this place last? Three days. We attacked the moment Premier Deshinko sat the Paddock, Baird. Ran into some swarm, but we're back on track. Also, Paddock, the cog that hammered you 50 years ago isn't us. We're not them. Well, if you launch those satellites, you'll be doomed to make the same mistakes. What is this knob even on about?
to launch the hammer yourself, but now you're saying it's a mistake. What gives? You launch, you buy us some time, but eventually they'll win. You must know this. No, I don't. The door's welded shut. Then that's the door you want. Here we go. All right, let's get set up. They're coming. Oh shit, we got poppers! Don't let them get too close! platform should we hit first? Make the call. Choices, choices. All right, off we go then. <laughs> uh, having a problem, pal? No, just figuring it out. So our friend Paddock's got some uh, interesting thoughts on the hammer con. <laughs> Oozing to judge. He tried to launch it himself. Okay. Let's get that thing loaded onto the nose cone. Let's try this. There, headlights on the move. Stay clear of that rail, people. Assist, Dad. No! 
hole. And our satellite's sitting pretty on the nose cone. One down. Then let's get the gantry over to the other side. Right. On it. Okay, let's go. Brace yourselves. This might be a little rough. Hey, what if Paddock's right about launching the set? Oh shit! Swarm on the other platform! The city ducks down here! Boss, get us higher! On it! Oh shit! This is the opposite of higher? I'm aware of that! Got it! Got it! Keep us moving! Doing my best! Got him! Appreciate it, Jack! Shit! Fire! And we got a bastard, too! Okay, let's go. Brace yourselves. This might be a little rough. Hey, what if Paddock's right about launching these satellites? Oh, shit! Swarm on the other platform! We're sitting ducks down here! Boss, get us higher! On it! This is the opposite of higher? I'm aware of that. Got it! Got it! Keep us moving! Doing my best! so we can connect the satellite.
Chakra, let's get this done. Oh no! Here comes satellite number two. That's it. All satellites secure. Back onto the gantry. Let's get him to the hangar. Uh, not to burst any bubbles, but we're not getting anywhere till we open that big round door. Uh, well, there's a platform up there. Head over to it. You read my mind. All aboard! Okay, so what if that is right? Launch these satellites is a bad idea. He's right that the hammer's dangerous. Believe me, get that now. Not launching these satellites is dangerous. Believe me. A world on fire is better than the world they want. We get this thing back to the hangar. We worry about the rest later. Let's try this. Guys, our ride's leaving. God oh, damn it. Opening that door must have triggered some automated sequence. So we babysit it on foot then. And I was just getting the hangar driving it. Come on, up these stairs. We can't lose that nose cone. There, let's keep up with it. Watch it, below us. Good assist, Jack. Satellites back to the hangar now. Good. We're still decrypting these old files, but we're making progress. Head out to your skiff. We'll find your rocket soon enough. All right. We're on our way. Come on. Once we're back in the hangar, we can work our way outside. Need some help. Okay. 
satellites are safe and sound. If we want to get out of here, we should cross the river. Shit! Guys, below us! Okay, they're down. Let's keep it moving, Delta. That'll work. Looks like we're all clear. Okay. Just so you know, whether we get the hammer working or not, we're ready for it. Yeah, but if we don't get the hammer working, whether you came or not, won't matter. We'll just find a way. Over there! Incoming! <laughs> So difficult. Hmm. A city. scientists, rocket scientists, and anyone who's used the expression, it's not rocket science. What do you think? We just push a button mark to launch? Oh, I see. Yeah, pick on the handsome one, cut him down to size. So, we're back across. And for the record, I'm the handsome one, okay? Paddock, we're almost out of here. Any leads on that rocket? Yes. At a turntable in the east, beyond the Dune Sea. There's a rail bridge blocking the way, but don't worry, my people will raise it for you. So, out in the desert, find train tracks, then you'll know you're on the right path. Copy that. All right, let's head for the skiff. You know, all this time I thought I was the handsome one. I'll take that. Hey, Paddock, still there? I got a question for you. No, I'm on launch break. Of course I'm still here. Okay, what exactly stops you from launching the hammer? The usual problems faced by 200 dedicated patriots trying to defeat 3,000 cowards. You know, you could just have agreed to the armistice and spared a lot of lives. A Groznian proverb for you. A just war is better than an unjust peace. So, just exactly how many Groznian proverbs justify war? Hey. Most of them. Children, one more thing. The bridge controls weren't network, so the base commander's virus didn't affect them. But the bridge itself hasn't been lifted in decades. What do you say? You worried about your people not being able to raise it? No, they'll handle it. But that bridge, it's old and rusty and... Just, when you're beneath it, don't linger. Copy that. All right, you heard him. Let's head for the bridge. So, this Paddock. How does Barrett even know him? Apparently, Paddock, sir. Come on, let's get past the bridge and over to that turntable. Oh, 
Boss, as of Asgari, are you feeling any, uh, I don't know, connection to this place? Nah. To be honest, I'm glad my parents came to their senses and left. I mean, growing up around here, in the desert, shaking sand wash from your shoes? Nah, I'm good, mate. You know this always wasn't a desert, right? Most of this used to be seashore. Long before I was born, mate. There's the bridge. I hope Paddock's nomads can raise it. There it goes! Well, they haven't dropped it yet! That's good, right? And we're through! On to the turntable! in the wrong direction, which is why it's called a turn. Grab the other side and let's get in there. Okay, now, how do we turn this thing? Started by finding a patrol. Hey, it's going. Perfect. Ready to move on. They spotted him! You know what to do, Delta! Uh. Thanks for the assist, Jack. Delta, by the left! Zion! Force is done! Grab the other side and let's get in there. Okay, now, how do we turn this thing? Start by fire. Four. Jack. 
Destroyer! Dead! Good one, Jack! Looks like a control room to me. Now to access the controls. Jack, get that train pointed toward the hangar. Skip order! Roman! 
Almost there! Kate, keep, keep going! This is a bridge control house. Bring us in close. Alright, go, go! to be fucking kidding me. Fair enough. Clock is ticking, people. The clock is not ticking. The clock is about to explode. Thanks, Jack. Got you. No, the bridge controls are wrecked. Then we bring it down the old-fashioned way. Okay, what the hell am I shooting at? That big clump. Don't bring it down. Appreciate it, Jack. Great coming. We gotta get that bridge down, now. Got it. Coming down! No oh, shit! That's a... No. No rest for the wicked people! Swarm! Come on, Delta! Put him down! Good one, Jack! We got a pouncer! Gotcha! <laughs> Appreciate it, Jack. Oh, coming in. Good assist, Jack. Got you. She figures out we're getting the hammer online. Again. Settlement tool shifted her thinking a bit. Obviously, no thanks to me. Meanwhile, I often wonder who stuffed that gigantic stick up her ass. <laughs> Firm no comment from Captain Phoenix on that one. Training facility for the beacons. Good to know. We are standing by. I've been wondering, how the hell did all this UIR space program stuff not get out? I mean, how did the cog keep it secret? Simple, when the cog off well. Guys, check out this crater. What the heck happened here? The cog happened. They fired a light mass missile on us when we were moments from seizing control of that entire facility. Wait, I'm confused. The car? I thought this was a UIR civil war.
Okay, Paddock. We're here. Listen. During our attack, I was certain the beacons were somewhere inside that place. But that computer virus locked us out of every building before I could get to them. And until your bot deals with that, you won't get to them either. Paddock, where do we start looking once we lift the virus? The centrifuge building. The beacons were most likely hidden there. Centrifuge. Got it. But move quickly. A storm is headed your way. Facilities activating, Delta. See? I knew Jack could do it. No sweat. Paddock, Jack cracked the virus. We're in. Then you now have full access to the entire facility. That's gotta be the centrifuge. And storm or no storm, we're heading over there. That's not exciting. Red Condor out there. Yo, Bear, you lose a Condor by any chance? Several, in fact, while running weapons to a certain, you know, desert-dwelling friend of mine. Keep whatever you find. Looks like we're gonna have to go through that storm to get there. Let's make it quick. Well, you pulled it! Look who's here! Yes, sir! Hey, let's go, bastard! Come on, put these assholes down! Appreciate it, Jack. All the exits are blocked. Now what? Jack, activate that crane. You got it! All right, Jack, let's do it again. Help 
me get this open. Okay, we're in. So where the hell are those beacons? Let's check the security cameras. Well, look who is. Oh shit, more of them. Guys, look. Beacons are tucked away in the capsule. Yeah, but how do we get them out? We could bring the arm around. There's a platform over there. Worth a shot. Jack, see what we can do. I can't believe that knackered thing still works. But it's not slowing down. Oi, fuck! What did you do? This thing's older than you are, man! That's not a miracle worker! What about an emergency ring? Well, there's a control in space. Catch it! <laughs> The beacons are okay. Come on, Jack, tell me the beacons are fine. Oh, thank God. Paddock, Baird, beacons are secure. They're also a hell of a lot bigger than I was expecting. 
I don't think we have room for a mole on the skiff. I'll have my people transport them. Fine, but Delta, I need one here ASAP to get a head start on calibrating them to our network in New Fira. Can you do that? Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll carry it to the skiff. <clears throat> well, that's heavy. All right, Baird, we're heading back. Paddock, send your people for the rest of these beacons when you can. Delta, let's get back to the skiff. Okay, let's go. Daddy, you good? Yeah, just lead the way. Well, storms no better. If anything, it's worse. Too bad. We're going back into it.
Jack, shot trap! Pulse! Nice work, Jack. Get down! And the door's open! Let's get our asses inside! Okay, skiff's not much farther. Yeah, easy for you to say. JD, how's the beacon? Not damaged. That's the important part. Kind of relying on you to keep it safe. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Way of the world, no pressure. Hear that? Storms died down. Yeah, now that we prove it. Come on, let's check on the skiff. Delta, let's get back to the skiff. You know something, Kate? You're pretty good at this military leadership thing. I'm not trying to be good at anything. Yeah, by the way, you're good at it. When we're done sharing the corporal with compliments, we should decide whether we're headed straight back to the airfield or not. Faz is right. Oh, man. I'm seeing an inch of my soul. Fortunately, it doesn't happen often. Okay, big fella. Let's get you aboard. So we meet again. Let's get that thing to Baird. Lead the Paddock, where's Baird? In back. He was explaining to me the new modification he made for your little pot frame. It was boring. So I came out oh, here. Yeah. We should probably unload this targeting beacon ASAP. Set that targeting beacon down. I'll deal with it in a bit. Gladly. Jack, look. Listen, kid, you still got a rocket to launch, and I need to get back to New Ophira. Yeah, right. Of course. JD, we're fine. I'm just working through it. We can talk later. I... 
appreciate that. Thanks. Paddock said you were working on something? Yeah, uh, a new and improved shield prototype for Jack. Go ahead. You installed. Tell us about it. It's actually very interesting. First, it creates an ionized vector. Baron, cancel class and get out here! Swarm coming in! Short version? Now get out there and use it! Cancel, come on! Nice work, Jack! You come into my house uninvited. You pay the price. Thanks. Come on, Les. Done! Everyone, get to the tarmac before Baird loses his ride home! <laughs> They're right on top of us! We're gonna clear this tarmac or Baird's not going anywhere! Come on, Delta, turn it up! You to stay, Baird. Appreciate it, Jack. You're dead. Okay. Airfield secure. Now Baird can get the here. Come on. Convoy, all right. All right, let's get in there and see what we can do. Look, they're still fighting. We gotta help them. Shock track. <laughs>
All right, we're clear. Now let's check on the beacons. Oh, they don't look damaged. It's easy, you do The bottle of it can do it, it can do it. Paddock, mate, you hearing this? He says the beacons are safe. I'll send someone to pick them up now. And don't worry, they'll be well armed. So go, deal with your rocket. All right, Delta out. All right, we're done here. Let's get back on the skiff. Delta, I'm heading out. I'll be in touch. All right, Baird. Safe travels. You too. Good luck. So, what's the plan now? The hangar. It's time to put that rocket together. Sounds good to me. What about Paddock's Nomads? They have stuck their necks out for us. Maybe we own something for that. Sure, but if we don't get our rocket launched soon, it's not just Paddock's Nomads we'll be worrying about. You know, I may have complained a bit, or a lot, thank you, Del. But this has actually been a pretty ripping time, all in all. To sum it up, eight out of ten. We'll do it again. And it's been surprisingly not terrible having you alone. Yeah, I'll take that. Yeah. Get the other side. Let's finish this. Paddock, we're back at the hangar. Everything should be ready. Good. Baird left instructions he asked me to read you. And I quote, Get inside. Initiate the rocket assembly procedure. Launch aforementioned rocket and hope these satellites talk to ours. End quote. Wait. Oh, the satellite talk to ours? What do you want from me? I can barely turn on a computer. Go press the button and see what happens. This better work. Paddock, rockets assembling. Look out! There's a bloody snatcher in here! did that on purpose. Who gives a shit? We need to get that nose cone back into place. Jack. Yes. Oh shit! Match is back!
We got them all. We gotta get on that gantry and realign the nose cone. Jack, get this thing aligned. All right, we're back in business. Then climb aboard the rocket. You can ride it straight to the launch pad.
Jack. Bullets have a
I'll never save you again. Wait, are you keeping score? So this is no affair. Home to industrialists, techno-fascists, reactionaries, and cowards. Yeah. Also, decent food, clean water, and showers. Eh, overrated. Delta, welcome home. Get cleaned up, then come to my workshop. I'll send someone for the beacons. Copy that, Baird. After you. Hey. Thank you, by the way. Oh, there's no need to thank me. Aww. Is the band back together, then? Should 